Well, thank you so much, Phil. And you're right, he is a rookie, but making quite a showing. It's quiet right now at headquarters, but I can tell you a short time ago, there was a jubilant mood here at his headquarters. Mr. Garvey walked out to speak to his supporters. He was surrounded by his family and his friends. And let's just say he had a feeling. What you are all feeling tonight is what it's like to hit a walk-off home run. Kind of like San Diego in 84. <laughs> because the networks have called it. We're going on to the general election to face off against Adam Schiff. Steve Garvey, of course, very well known to Californians because of his years as a Dodger and a Padre. And to be sure, there were lots of baseball metaphors that we heard here throughout his speech. But as a Republican running in a heavily Democratic state, he's got his work cut out for him in November. And he's done little fundraising or had much in the way of paid ads. But he walked out and spoke to reporters before he went out to the podium. And let's listen to what he had to say about a November runoff. Listen. What's coming next for you and will you be more visible? Well, I'm pretty visible now. We reached 9 million people uh, yesterday uh, through the media. Uh, and, um, you know, I won't be at work. So I'm in places where, um, you know, the press isn't always there. And I think that's important. Uh, so all, all this about uh, media spending is choice. It's free will and choice by our opposition. Uh, what I'm able to do on a very small budget, because they just started, I think it should be fascinating for all of you about a team that we put together that's able to do reach 9 million people in one day and probably 15 million people in the last week. Garvey was wearing a gray suit and he carried a quiet confidence about him during the time that he was out here addressing the crowd. And he actually, before he left the dais, he threw out a few baseballs. People love that.